In June, I spent four nights at the Royal Decameron Cornwall Beach Resort in Montego Bay in Jamaica. This was my first post-pandemic trip and I wanted to take it easy. I wanted an all-inclusive by the beach with good food and the Royal Decameron fit the bill. The resort is about 10 minutes away from the Montego Bay airport which is nice. As previously mentioned, it was a short trip and I had undertaken just two excursions, one to the Luminous Lagoon and the other a longer trip to the Vias Falls. This resort is part of the Royal Decameron chain and the Royal Decameron Montego Beach Resort is the neighbor to the right. We had arrived around 2 p.m. at the resort and the room was not ready. However, we could enjoy the buffet lunch. It was indeed a splendid feeling to be in a humid dining room with all the traits of a tropical country and this was after two years. After lunch, the room was ready. We were in the last floor which is the fifth floor. All rooms face on one side the beach. We had a twin bed plus a third bed for a child in case there were one. The balcony was spacious. The typical tropical country fashion, the room had a shower and not a tub, just the way I like. The room contained all the necessities including the TV set which I never used, the iron, the safe box, a mini refrigerator. They also gave us two bottles of water every day which is a nice gesture. With only 146 rooms, the Cornwall Beach Resort is a smaller one compared to some of the other all-inclusives I have been to. The resort has only one buffet hall for breakfast, lunch and dinner. There was also a bar outside the buffet hall. And it has two a la carte restaurants. One is the Oliver which specializes in Mediterranean cuisine while the other is Souk which is a Jamaican fusion restaurant. The restaurants are shared between both resorts. Besides the lobby bar, it has a cafe too, as well as a pool bar. Obviously, the pool bar is besides the pool. The pool itself is a lengthy one, which is ideal if one wants to have a good long swim. Throughout the day, there were various activities by the pool from bingo to dance lessons and dancing. In the evenings, there were musical and dance events. Some events were held by the beach locations shared by both resorts. And there were times I felt that perhaps the other resort had more active nighttime entertainment events. The strongest point of the resort is the beach. It has soft golden sand and the waters were generally warm by late morning. But a few dozen feet away from the shore, the water gets deeper. I was lucky because for most of the time, the weather was nice and the beach was calm. And it was a nice view to see the planes passing by to land at the nearby airport. The resort also has a few non-motorized activities such as kayaks, canoes and catamarans. I haven't done kayaking in a long while so I took a mini lesson before getting into the kayak. Well as you can see it was a hit and miss before I managed to get the hang of it. I didn't try the other available non-motorized facilities. 
Sitting on a patch of sea between both resorts are some shallow reefs and twice I took a dip. It was such a marvelous sight with all those tiny fishes swimming around. The food was fabulous. One could get everything from breakfast cereals to bread to salads to freshly cut vegetables to all types of non-vegetarian dishes including of course the jerk chicken and jerk pork dishes as well as the traditional Jamaican fish soups. There were also fresh omelettes, pasta and other items available. I had booked dinner at both a la carte restaurants. I felt that the dinner at the Mediterranean was tastier, but it could also be that I had too much expectations from the souk as it was a Jamaican specialty restaurant. On the last day, I took a walk outside of the resort and found some small local eateries. It is a pity that I waited for so long to venture out because I would have loved to try some local restaurants. If you want a quieter vacation in a smaller all-inclusive resort with a nice beach, pool, good food and drinks, this can be a place for you.